play a character whose whose name is Joe, um, because Ryan uh, wrote the part for me. It was the first time that ever happened to me in my life that a writer wrote a part for me to play. It's a real honor that that happened. Um, and he is a looper, and what that means is he's a, he's a special kind of assassin that uses time travel to dispose of his victims. And uh, he's organized crime circuits in the future because you can't commit murder in the future, it's too difficult. They send their victims back in time, and uh, the looper disposes of them. But uh, because it's so illegal, and the, the criminal organization in the future wants to sever all ties with me at one point, uh, they send me my future self to kill. Uh, unfortunately, my future self is Bruce Willis, so I'm not able to kill him, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> uh, that's, that's kind of uh, the premise, and then it goes from there. And then Emily, he enters your life in a very sort of unexpected, he does. disturbing I, way. I can't say too much about my character, Sarah, because um, she and her family get embroiled in all of this mess when Joe is a pussy and lets Bruce Willis run. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Bruce Willis, come on. Um, and so myself and my family get very much embroiled in this whole uh, debacle. And uh, they are proving to be a threat to me in that way. But she's a very, very tough, um, she's a badass. I'm just going to say it. She's really cool. She, I live in the middle of nowhere in the, in the Midwest. So all of these American actresses are like, screw you, Brit! <laughs> no, they weren't. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was very exciting, very exciting role to play. Well, we're going to take some more questions. I know there's a lot of